Hey, great people. This is the Apostle, Reginald Delmaine Thompson. I wanted to give you a word of encouragement today with some information that I wish I knew and I wish somebody shared this information with me because without great information, it's impossible to make great decisions. When I was 20 years old, I wish I had this information here. First, rid yourself of toxic people because toxic people will pull you down. You're not able to heal if you're in a process of healing from childhood hurts or some type of trauma in your life. And the thing is, you have to learn how to protect your peace. These people will rule over you and have much uh, of influence over your life if you allow them to. So you have to rid yourself from toxic people in order to protect your peace and as well uh, to be able to heal. Uh, properly because you cannot heal in the same place that actually hurts you. So rid yourself of these people. Number two, I want you to know that you don't need to seek approval from anybody. You don't need to ask permission at 25 years old to those who are around you. S sweetheart, you're 36, 25, you're, you're 40 years old. You do not need to seek approval. I know people that are still seeking approval at the age of 50 and 55 and 60 years old, uh, they, they are, they're seeking approval from people who have no authority in their life. I know they have a great influence, but you don't have to seek approval from them. If it's a good idea, if it's a witty idea, if it's a perfect uh, thought out plan, then execute it. You don't need their permission. You are grown. Go. The only person you need to seek approval from is God. Go to God in prayer. Go to God and meditate and speak to God and get an answer. Make sure that you you speak into the universe. Make make sure you speak into the spirit realm and get an answer from God. You don't need to go to this individual. I don't care if it's a brother, a sister, a, a, a cousin. You don't need to seek approval from them. You're damaging who you are. Third and lastly, I'm going to tell you this. Sometimes people will try to tell you what you shouldn't do and how you should do it. Well, you can't accomplish this goal this way because I did it this way and you shouldn't do it this way. Listen, everybody's journey is not the same. And so you, you do not, you do not have to take advice from people concerning how they did it on their journey and how their journey went from them. Your journey is your journey. Their journey is their journey. You can hear what they have to say and be thankful for the information uh, that you heard from them. But do it differently. Be original. Be your own self. Do something different. Be original and do something different than what they did. You don't have to do it their way. That was their way. That was their journey. So I would say to you, hey, do it your way. Have it your way. <laughs> do it your way. And if you do it that, that way, then you will have a testimony to give. See, they're giving you a testimony of how they survived it. So I'm telling you to do the same. Go out here and accomplish the whole world and be great at it. This is your boy, the Apostle, Reginald Delmaine Thompson. I approve this message. Have a wonderful day.